Hello. In this video, I'd like to share some of what you will learn in Mesa's iLogic Essentials class. In the class, you will learn about the iLogic rule editor and ways to apply iLogic to help automate segments of your design process. In this case here, I have an iLogic rule that is set up to suppress a feature or two whenever the uh, style is set a specific way and then turn those features off and other ones on depending upon another setting. So if I go up here to my, my parameters and I just quickly change this parameter, you'll see that the part behind is turning off and on certain features. We can use the same type of approach in assemblies as well. So here I have some parameters that will change the end flange to round or square. I can then pick a pipe OD and you'll see the pipe then sizes accordingly and also the hole in that part and the flanges change size and then also the pipe length can be switched to predetermined sizes. Once you have your rules created and your model reacting the way you want it to, you can also create forms. Forms are essentially a customized dialog box that give you access to key parameters, I properties, and other rules that you want to be able to run. So you don't have to go into those other dialogs. You can see here, I've got these parameters set up here so I can configure my model without having to go into, say, the cumbersome parameter dialog box. Another topic you'll learn about are event triggers. If I go to my Manage tab here and go to my event triggers, we can determine when we want rules to run off, based off of certain events like before save, after save, etc. You can do that on all your documents, parts specifically, assembly specifically, drawings, or the actual open document. In our case here, let's say that we want all of our drawings to run this create PDF rule after we save it. So I can click and drag to the after save. So now based off of this event trigger, every time I save a drawing, it will also run this rule, which will then create a PDF and store it in a specific location based off of the way the rule is set up. All this and more is covered in Mesa's iLogic Essentials course. You can check out the course schedule in the link in the description, and also there is a link to our full course catalog. If you'd like to sign up, feel free to give us a call or you can email me directly.